Hi tribe, welcome back. We're Twin Oracles here, back again. We hope you're having an incredible day so far filled with magic, blessings, love, and miracles, because they do happen every day. We're back here with another general reading, so take this message, whatever resonates with you, and leave the rest. If you're looking for a personal read that's catered to you personally, that information is linked down below. We also do offer family constellations, which is ancestral patterning healing. If that resonates, look into that further as well or reach out. Thank you new viewers and seasoned viewers that have been here since the beginning. We're grateful and thankful to you all. For some of you, there's a channeled message coming through where you're waiting for an offer or you received an offer and this offer will allow you to take action and move forward in life. So take that how it resonates. Others of you are moving forward and growing and healing and expanding from a hurtful and painful situation. You're looking on to brighter, sunnier days. And you're thinking about that situation logically rather than emotionally. And you're bringing your heart and your mind back into balance so that you can move forward. So I hope those channeled messages resonate with you. If any of those channeled messages resonate with you, please comment down below and claim that to be yours. Let's dig in. God, what is the most important message that our lovely viewers need to know today? What is the most important message that our lovely viewers need to know today? All right. All right. So this is beautiful. Whew. Okay, so this is clear and beautiful and concise. Now, we have a large group of you here that you're very intuitive, okay? You could be seers, you could be visionaries, you could be male or female, doesn't matter. You can be a high priest or high priestess, you can be a sage, a wise woman, a wise man, a shaman, a shaw woman. Take it how it resonates. Or you can just be highly intuitive where you, you feel things, okay? But what I'm picking up here is that quite literally, you can see someone coming into your life. <laughs> it's beautiful. It's like you can see them coming before they enter your life and you're waiting for them. Others of you, you're already in a partnership and one, like either you or the other person, place yourself where, where you resonate but you or the other person are holding back. You're not showing your affection all the way or fully. You're wanting to hold back a little bit, maybe to protect your heart. Um, but it feels like that's coming to an end because now you just want to give it all you have. You're hearing the call to give it all you have. This is quite profound this message okay because the further I look into it and dig deep into it for some of you 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 just looked at the clock and it says two 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 others of you you looked at a receipt and on that receipt it says two 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 for others of you you could be 22 years old There's, it, it feels like your life is coming into balance and your life, it feels like it's being picked up and pulled up into the hands of God and God has you safely and securely in this beautiful cloud and he's just making things happen beautifully in your life. 
For others of you, you're, if you're not in a relationship but you met someone that you had liked, you're holding back, maybe you're playing the, the game that's, oh no, I, I can't call first, you know, or, you know, you can't give your power away. But for some of you, if you like this person, you're being asked to make the call, to give them a call and tell them how you feel. It, it's like there's so much love here, but what happens is the fear gets the best of you because of the fact here we go because of the fact that you were hurt in the past and okay so this makes sense now the channeled message that i had mentioned earlier was speaking of you moving forward and expanding and healing from this past hurt and past pain you might want to pause this video as i just looked it said five 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 <laughs> okay so there's a lot of synchronicities in this video it's very profound this video is just nonstop filled with synchronicities. You may want to rewind the video to the beginning after you've watched this all the way through. Watch it again and, and re-listen to the channeled messages because it feels like for some of you, you have your guards up and you're in your mind because you're scared of getting hurt the way that you got hurt in the past. And that's why you're not, that's why you're holding back here. That's why you're not showing your true colors or your true feelings to this person. That's why you're not calling first because you have a boundary up, a wall up against around your heart. And so you're being asked to heal your heart from this, to free yourself from this and be confident in knowing that this person has been brought to you by God. There's no doubt about it. This person has been brought to you by God. This could be a twin flame. Uh, this could be a soul flame, place it how it resonates. But this is a love that's built to last and it's been, it's been brought to you by God. You've been praying for this. You've been asking for this beautiful love to come. Please don't allow it to be sabotaged by the mind. This is your twin flame, your divine counterpart that you are meant to be in. The last thing you want to do is miss out on this opportunity and have regrets. The last thing you want to do is take this broken heart of yours and bring it into this kind of a relationship. Or the last thing you want to do is hold back your love and hold back your emotions and hold back your true feelings from this person and they miss out and you miss out. This is the last thing you want to do. You don't want to have any regrets because this is the love of a lifetime. Now, obviously, this is a general read, so take it how it resonates. If you're meeting someone right here right now or you met someone and there were a bunch of red flags, that's not the person that I'm referring to here. I'm referring to someone where it's clear there are no red flags, okay? But there's unhealed trauma here that's been asked to heal. Now when, you also have two major arcanas here. So this is in God's hands. God's asking you to take the call to heal to heal your heart from the past and to give this relationship, whoever what or whatever this is, to give it a chance to reawaken it, to give it a chance to birth. Wow. <laughs> I'm going to ring the bell here. I'm going to ring this beautiful singing bowl. And I ask that you just do, you know, a 30 second or one minute deep breathing here to release all the pain that's in your heart. Okay, so let's do that now. Close your eyes and just take deep, slow breaths in and out and just release whatever's in your heart. Please don't carry this forward. You need to release whatever's in your heart, not just for this relationship to work, but for your own health. For your own health, don't hold on to this any longer. Okay? Let bygones be bygones. All right, so I'm gonna ring the bell. Just do some deep breathing and try to clear away at least the first layer of this pain.
All right, so I hope that helped to clear a little bit of the energies. Remember, healing comes up in layers. Let's dig into the Island Time Wellness card here. So the most important thing to take away from this message is that you have choices to make here. You have decisions, sorry, you have decisions to make. You can call them or not. You can express the way that you feel or not. You can bring this, this reconciliation, give this relationship a new chance or not. You can heal from the past or not. You can let go of the past or not. You can let go of bygones and let them be bygones or not. So if this is resonating with you, please comment down below. If you're ready to let bygones be bygones, please, please cl claim it down below. Claim it down below and give it a thumbs up and say, yes, I am ready to let bygones be bygones. I'm ready to let this situation go. Claim it to be yours. That's one of the best ways to manifest is to type things, to write things, to speak things out loud. So claim this to be yours if you want this to be yours. But you have decisions to make here. You have three big decisions to make here. But you're being called. You're being summoned. It's up to you what you choose. Okay, so what, I, what am I saying? All right, beautiful. First card out, you have passion, okay? You cannot deny this twin flame or soul flame energy, okay? There is so much passion here, it's crazy. You both like each other so much. Please share with this person how you feel, okay? Don't hold back. Don't be like, oh, well, if I write first, then I'll lose my power. No, you don't want to lose this. It's not about losing your power. You don't want to lose this person, okay? Love is at stake here, and that's what we'll call this. Love is at stake. The second card that you have, beautiful, is engagement ring. You do not want to miss out on this love that is at stake. Okay, this is a long lasting, everlasting relationship that's available here to you, a partnership. It could even just be like a lifelong partner. It could just be lifelong friends. Place it how it resonates. But this is something beautiful and you are being called you are being summoned. So it's up to you if you want to take the call or not. It's always up to you. Follow your heart. Follow your heart. It will always guide you. This is just beautiful. This is beautiful. Okay. I've, whew, this is one of the most beautiful reads that we've had till date. So take it for what it is. Okay. It's beautiful. Hear the call, answer the call. You have decisions to make here, okay? So grateful and thankful to have you here. We love you as always. If this resonated, please like the video, please share the video and subscribe to our channel. We're Twin Oracles, where you have two twins for the price of one. If you're interested in a personal reading, that information is linked down below. Until the next time, we love you as always. Bye for now.